guys welcome back to my channel so today's video i will be recreating leah's j's thanksgiving holiday tutorial video this is a very old video this is like one of her first few videos when she first started her youtube channel this is six years old but i decided i want to recreate this look because Aaliyah j has been one of my biggest inspirations on youtube yes i look totally different yes this is 2019 yes this is a wig over my red hair <sighs> so <laughs> If you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like, comment, and let's go ahead and get straight to the video because it's so much fun. <laughs> All right, so I don't have every single product that she has. I have something similar to it or close to it, so just bear with me. Um, I haven't done a video like this in a while, so whatever. I'm going to have her up on my TV screen back here. Oh, Lord, I know my, my hair look a mess. Look at my ears. I mean, I'm gonna slap a wig on anyway because I don't have black hair. She has black hair. So I'm gonna try to do my best to get the video as close as I can to it. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna have her up on my big screen TV and I'm gonna be moving my camera up and downward so you guys can see her because I don't know how good you guys can see her back there. Let's see. Something like that. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and see what she got going on. All right, so she's using a primer for her eyes. So the primer that I have is, of course, the Elf Hydrating Primer. I always use this primer. This is like my favorite primer. But I'm gonna hydrate my whole, yeah. I'm gonna prime my whole face because it's 2020, you know? using is at the bottom of the video but the freaking screen is very good. Alright. So she used the eyeshadow uh, the primer as an uh, eyeshadow base I'm guessing. I don't have a lighter primer to do that so instead I'm going to use the color natural to just prime my eyes give it that nice soft base So my eyes are set now. They're done. Uh, when I, whenever, just FYI, whenever I use too much product on one eye, I always just transfer it to the other eye using the brush. Now, let's see what she's up here doing. She used the Urban Decay um, primer. And then she used the Max Saddle Sigma E40. So the set, the color saddle and the brush Sigma E40. I don't have the Urban Decay. And plus this video is like five, six years old. I don't have the Urban Decay, of course. So I'm going to work out of my Morphe eyeshadow palette. My baby. My first ever eyeshadow palette. And I'm going to get the color as close to what she has. It's like a very, very light brown shade. So with that being said, I'm going to use my hair morphe boss palette um eyeshadow palette and my little fluffy brush here and i think i think this color will probably be the lightest brown shade in here so i'm gonna use this and i'm just gonna work that up here like how she did in the video
now we're gonna go ahead and get back to the video and see what she does next where's the remote all right now she's using the mac brown script and the sigma e25 it's like a reddish it's like a reddish brownish color i think this color might be closer to it this one maybe i'm not gonna use a lot of it because like i said that it looks like a brownish red so i'm gonna keep this eyeshadow palette i'm gonna take this here brush i have a brush similar to that brush it's my morphe brush but the bristles on there are so horrible now i'm not gonna even much worry about it so i'm gonna take this shade here using this little brush this is the blended eyeshadow brush i got this from the dollar general because i was doing a video using dollar general products but whatever and i'm gonna take that and put it like right where she at? All right, she got it like right above her upper lid. And see, she has more, she has smaller eyes than I do, so. So this is what I am left with as far as the eyeshadow go. I'm gonna watch what it looks like on the camera. All right, so she's using the Urban Decay Naked Palette Smog, S-M-O-G on the eyelid and half baked in the inner corner so she used a little gold in here and then she used like a little white in here and i think i have that in that eyeshadow palette all right so she added the white eyeshadow base to the bottom the part where i applied the shadow got deleted okay all right cool so that part got deleted but i'm gonna show it to you guys so basically she used like a gold on her lid she did apply the white eyeshadow base from nyx I actually threw away mine. I threw it away a long time ago, like a year ago. So I already have, I still have a little product on my um, lid from the eyeshadow. So I don't want to cake it too much. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and add that gold and that white shade. And like I said, I have those colors, similar colors in here, which would be this gold and this white. I'm going to just use my finger. Sometimes your fingers work best anyway. So now she has that white in her inner corner. I'm gonna take this little uh, brush here that I used to apply my concealer. And of course, I wiped off the concealer. I'm just gonna stick that right here. Kinda like how she got it. From what I've seen in this video, she did not use foundation 
I'm gonna use foundation. I need to have a mustache, so I'm not gonna use that much. Like I'm not gonna do a full face of foundation. I'm really gonna just cover up my lip. Ooh, I'm knocking stuff over. Urban Decay Naked Palette in the color Sin. So now she's adding stuff to her eyebrow. And I'm gonna just use that same white that I used in my inner corner for my eyebrows, so. So I didn't see what eyeliner that was, but I did get some eyeliner. Ow, my finger. I did uh, grab a, uh, my inflatable long wear eye pencil. And I think this will help a lot more with my wing liner because I can't do it for crap. So I'm just going to close my eye and just go to work. I don't like this because I normally use my NYX eyeliner because it's a hell of a lot blacker. See how gray this shit look? So annoying. Since I gotta hold this. <laughs> the 2011 of it all she used the Too Faced three way um, eyeliner so with that being said that explains a lot because Too Faced is good product so now she's using the Kat Von D lock in tattoo concealer I don't have that i have me some nyx concealer but like i said she didn't use foundation i need foundation on my lips so i'm gonna use my color corrector of course to darken up to color correct my top lip so i decided to cut out me using the foundation and the color corrector due to the fact that it wasn't used in the vi the, the, vi the vehicle <laughs> the video so yeah we're just gonna skip that part all right, so now we're gonna finally do what she's doing and use us some concealer. She's using the Kat Von D con tattoo concealer. I'm just gonna use my NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop concealer in the color golden, and I'm gonna highlight with the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop color beige. You see where she's putting on her concealer? I don't know if she's just putting it under her eye or not. The MAC Prep um, highlighter she used, but it looked like she only put concealer under her eye. I know she does a lot more now. She does a full face beat, but I know she looked back and be like, "What the? What was I thinking?" <laughs> So, like I said, she used the cat, um, not cat, she used the MAC prep highlighter. I'm going to use, so the highlight, I'm going to use the color beige and my NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer.
you can see what a difference light is. <laughs> I think it's the lighting. Then again, I don't know. Whatever. Gotta contour my nose anyway. Kinda cute. Like I'm looking in the mirror and on the camera I know it look crazy, but in the mirror it looks it's really pretty. <laughs> Oh, she already, um, I think she's going to mention this in a minute that she used, that she added false teeth. I'm probably blocking the way. so she did add some to her chin. I applied falsies and bottom eyeliner. Now time for contour and blush. Elf blush and bronzer palette. Sigma F05. Alright, so I saw that she added a little bit to her chin. So I'm just going to take the, whatever left product I have left and add it down there. And she did go all the way up like I did. So I'm going to go ahead. The falsies that I'm using, I like the glue set. The falsies I'm using are KC by the Jania Michelle uh, Eyelash Company. Well, not eyelash company. She had a sponsorship or whatever with this Boss Main Links um, company on Instagram. And so I'm going to be using the Casey eyelashes. Because I feel like these are my most natural looking eyelashes that I own. Y'all know I like big and dramatic. So while those are drying, I'm going to add the eyeliner underneath my eye. Alright, so my lashes are drying. Oh my god. I don't know what it is. Ooh. Maybe that, I don't know. But anyway, I'm about to add the eyeliner underneath my eye. And so it looked like she did probably a little mascara under there. So I'm gonna add a little bit of mascara down there. So, I'm still waiting on them to dry, so I'm going to just take some of the contour and go ahead and start adding the contouring and whatnot to my face, because that's what she's doing. So, I'm just going to take a little bit. She used a bronzer. I don't have a bronzer anymore. So, sorry. <laughs> so, I'm going to, and she did contour her nose, but in the video, she did not show it. So, I'm going to go ahead and do my nose as well. Go ahead and start doing this. Well, we're gonna do it how, how she did it. She thought that's the lip scene she doing, so I need to catch up. <laughs> so she just did this. Y'all know I like to do circle of motion when I'm doing like my contour, so. And she got in diamond earrings. I got in hoops. She ain't gotta be exactly the same. And I saw her go a little bit over her forehead like this. And she said she used some blush, but all I saw was she did the contour. So I'm gonna just add the blush myself. I need to put some on the nose. The nose is something about the nose.
So that's what that looks like. It's not as close to hers, but like I said, these are the closest I have to natural eyelashes. Y'all know I like to look like a bird getting ready to take off. So, this is the lashes using. About all in the way. NYX lip liner natural. I don't have natural, so I'm not gonna use that. I do have brown. So she's using like a pink lip liner, adding the NARS Gloss Gold Digger on top. Alright, so she finished up. So now it's time for us to finish up. So I'm going to use the brown NYX lip liner. Of course, she had more of a pink shade, so I'm not going to go too deep. And I have a hell of a lot bigger lips than the Leah <laughs> So, I'm just going to add a very thin line. The closest I have is the Dose of Colors um, lip liner in the color P234. And I think I got this for like free or a gift or something. I don't even remember. I never used it. So, I'm going to use it today. Now, I do have a, um, it's still not as light as hers, but I do have a dose of colors, pink, like, lip gloss or whatever so I'm gonna grab that real quick and then I'll be right back so I'm gonna go ahead and throw on a wig <laughs> to make it look ow I'm gonna throw on a wig to make it look more like hers and I'll be right back all right so this is what I look like I know my wig look crazy this wig is old it's the bane wig and I literally just slick some stuff down <laughs> Can lay Okay, so, I have more of a pink lip going on than a nude, but whatever, but this is, I, I got food to turn my head. I feel like Wendy Williams when I did that, you know how she be drinking her tea, she go, <laughs> but anyway, so this is the finished look, pull my camera down just a little bit, so this is the finished look, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe comment i feel like this makeup is really really cute every time i try something different it winds up being a little cute i i mean i know this is so 2011 2012 15 makeup type of deal but you know it's different for me because y'all know i don't really like pink lips i didn't even think i could pull off pink lips but apparently i can but yeah so go ahead like comment subscribe let me know how i did leah j if you see this video thank you for being such an inspiration for me and starting my YouTube channel and I hope to see everybody in my next video.